Good morning, I'm Chip. Hey, good morning, I'm Steve. I'm Harry. Harry. John. John. Bob. Bob. Keith. Keith. And this is Chip's, Chip's Garage. Garage. Hey, as you guys can see, we're moving up in the world. We got a banner when we go to shows. Uh, when we go to where, Steve? Gee. Where are we going to go with this? Oh, uh, let's see. Let's see. Chip's Garage. We're going to SEMA. Yeah, SEMA. Right we're going to go to SEMA. Yeah, we're yeah, dreaming. Yeah, yeah. We're I dreaming. If, if anybody out there likes our show enough and knows somebody, get us into SEMA. We're all hey, for listen, it. Hey, so. listen. Jay Leno. It's on our... It's Jay on our, Leno, I love to see him. Yeah, yeah. Know? It's on our bucket yeah. list. Drink a little so. wine with Jay Leno. Yeah, yeah well, I don't, I don't, I don't yeah, drink. Yeah, I'll, I don't. I'll have a nice tea with Jay okay, Leno. Okay, I see you. That'd be cool. So anyway, we got Harry with us again here today. Come on up here, Harry. Harry. And... uh He's brought in our car. If you remember him, he brought his Shelby Cobra Daytona, Shelby Cobra. which by the way, I couldn't fit in. Yeah, yeah, no, you couldn't yeah. get out. You could fit this in. This one I can. Get out. This one yeah. I can. But um, we got uh, uh, like almost three thousand views yeah. already on yeah. that, which is really, yeah. really good, and it's growing. So uh, anyway, thank you everybody Very, for thank watching. You. Right, really but today, good. Harry brought us uh, another one of his cars, and he's got another one. He was telling me about. It. I'm not going to say okay, what no, it no, is. Okay, no, 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 no. But uh, say, yeah. he's got another one. I think he's going to bring to us too. But Harry, I'm going to let you run with it, buddy. What do we got here? Okay, this is a 1955 Ford Thunderbird, the first year of the Thunderbird. First year. Yeah. Now you were telling us the story about Corvette and Thunderbird, mm -hmm. and and mm -hmm. share that with the viewers. A little competition yeah, there. Of course, Corvette came out in '53. When Ford heard about that, they decided they needed a sports car. So they got the hustling and developed the Thunderbird. Well, of course, the Corvette, the first two years, only had the six cylinder. Yeah, right, that's right. a straight blue, blue, blue flame. flame yeah. Blue flame six. Yeah. Right. And then uh, in 55, when this came out with the V8, they came out with their V8. I think mm -hmm. it was a 265. It wasn't the 283, I think two, 265. Well, First year this came out, they were hoping to sell 10,000 cars. Instead, they sold over 16,000. Wow. So it's way oversold. Pretty, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the Corvette in 55 only sold less than 700. Unbelievable. Now, now you're seeing the difference. This is a metal car. All metal. Corvette. That's is, right. Except for the hard right. top. Yeah. That's hard right. Top. Yeah. And uh, Corvette's all fiber. Yeah. 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 People really didn't like the Corvette yeah. when they first came out. Oh. And you know, they've really only become popular dollar wise, right, what right, they're right, worth. Right. Really, the last right. 10 years. Right, right, right. I mean, I remember, you know, 15 years ago, yeah. you could still buy those for nothing to 55, 56. Lower price. I think 50, yeah. Yeah. not 57. I think it was no. 55. Yeah. No, no 50, I'm sorry, 50. No, no, you're right. The uh, 63 came out in 63. The split window. Yeah, so this. No, they're no. always. Big I'm, money. I'm off on this. 53, 53. 53. It's the 53 and 54 and 55 yeah. that were all the yeah, same, yeah. or just 53 and they 54? They were very similar, except they had V8 and 55. Yeah, so 56 would have been the big change. Yeah, it looks like that's when they became popular. Okay. Well, the okay. reason being is 53, 4, and 5 were very crude cars. Yes. Uh, and then T Bird came out. They had the power windows, power seats. Um, the creature comforts. Yeah. Uh, gentleman's yeah. muscle car. Yeah. Right. Was, uh, well, it was considered a sports car, right? Yeah, yeah. More of a exactly. sports car. American sports car. But right. of course, this has been changed a little bit. We'll look at that. Right. But let's start going and, around and, it. Oh, oh, Go oh, ahead. oh. And when the first Corvettes came out, as me as a mechanic, the mechanics were cracking the bodies. They didn't know how to jack these. Oh, cars yeah. Up. I remember you know, hearing and, it. And yeah. nothing fit right on these. Cars. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. Like, Early fiberglass. Yes. Let's take a look up front here again. And oh, we always pointed out on these older cars. Okay. Just look at the style oh. and look at the chrome on this thing. So here's your are these running lights and blinkers, Harry? Yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. running lights and blinkers. Of course, your headlight. Interesting, they didn't put in chrome around the headlight. That was pretty There popular. is an option that you can get an eyebrow. Oh, you could? I got yeah, you. okay, okay. All right, so so some options on this car, some options not. Okay, okay. Look at the beautiful bumper the going yeah, across. It is. It's and, and this reminds me of a 55 Chevy grill in a way. Oh, really? Yeah, a little bit. You had to go to Chevy, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, right right I know, we keep doing that. Here, we just keep right doing here. that. Yeah, it's right there, you know. I'll twist it. This also came with bumper Yeah, bumper okay. that's right, yeah. But no, it's it's absolutely gorgeous, and I love this yeah, here. Now, too. now, is there a signal, you know, uh, with Chevy, There's this means something, right? A big block, I think, if you had the flags. Does anybody remember? I don't remember that. Does it, does it have any meaning on the Ford, why the flags are there? I, I don't know. I okay, okay. Now, this is shared the same response as shared the same similarities, I'm sorry, as a 55 Ford car, passenger car, isn't it yeah, correct? Yeah, they had to rush this into production, so they did use a lot of sedan parts sedan. on it. Yeah. And the design's similar, the fenders. Man, so and cool. 
Um, no, tail lights and headlights look very similar. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Look at and the look slope at here, how, how it goes up and over. I mean, just beautiful design. Now, especially kinda, for the first year, you yeah. know what I mean? It, it kind of looks like a, a widened sunbeam tiger. It, you know what you know, it does. It kind of does. Yeah. You know, doesn't it? Look, yeah. look of course, at the factory oh, yeah. hood scoop. That. I mean, beautiful. factory functional yeah, hood functional. scoop. Yeah. And when you see what's underneath, you guys are going to be blown oh, yeah, away, yeah, by yeah, the way. Away. So, I mean, the color is just beautiful. What color was yeah. it? This is fire red. No, uh, it's not original color. Not original. Not original. Okay. Color. So it was originally a black color. Black car. Okay. It looks great, great, great. You put red, disc brakes on it because what's under the hood is going to need it. Right. So he's got Updated. disc brakes. Yep. Are they Willwood or no? They're Scarebird, which is okay. okay. Actually, uh, I believe the rotors are Camaro. Okay. okay. Very good. <laughs> and he and he's got disc up front, and he's got drum in the back with a four nine inch. Right. But, what size drum are they? Uh, uh, they were the probably big, 10 or 11. Big, uh, big drum. 57 Ford uh, station wagon. Okay, oh, okay. So they're so, big yeah, and big yeah they would have okay. been 10 or 11. Uh, Krager's. That was, oh, that yeah. was it. Krager SS. Well, Krager SS. Krager SS. Krager SS was you you can it. never go wrong with Krager SS. Nah. And again, we want to point it out. This is not an original car. This is, um, I don't know if you call I call it a hot rod. Is, what hot rod, yeah. is that what you would call it, Harry? Hot rod, yeah. 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 This not is not a, a rustle mod or anything, but no, a hot rod. Yeah, no, yeah. This rod. is this is an old school, old school, school actually hot rod, yeah. hot rod which yeah. we'll get into. Yeah. But probably let's, something from the sixties. Let's point this with. out. Now this would have been original, right? Right, right? Yeah, so really cool, but this was added. Uh, and, we're, and we're giving away a uh, secret. Uh, here. You're giving away, <laughs> Jeff. Now they heard us mention Chevy's a couple times, but you're wrong. Okay, so no, I'm, no, I'm not no, going to go no, any further. No, 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 no. Uh, Let, you're wrong. Let guess. Yeah, you're wrong. Oh, and, and talk about the flap that used to be here. Oh, wow. yeah, yeah, yeah. 56. 56, they put it there. This is 55. Right. First year, 56. They, well, 55, they found it was very hot in there. Yeah, no air. So put a door here that swung open. Right. Yeah, cool air on yeah so there would have been a little panel here, yeah, and it yeah. flipped open. You pulled a, a hey, thing inside, and it flipped Crosby open, and it gave you air in the cockpit. Yeah, yeah. Because it got so hot, hot in there. Yeah. Now the other change that they changed from fifty-five to fifty-six, which auto fifty-seven was the porthole, right? That's right. Fifty-five yeah. people complained they couldn't see out right. of the car. Right. Right. So they put the portholes in, which are cool. Yeah. yeah. But I don't want to modify. So it would have been no, a round no. hole right here. Was that Susanna with, Summers with, with kind of glass. Yeah. 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 Look how beautiful the oh, door beautiful. handles. Again, the design is just amazing. I like this. Yeah, now, now a lot of that. kids wouldn't know this is where you put the key to open, uh, lock and unlock the door. Yeah, but so there's a little And there's a spring. A yeah. little indentation yeah. for your finger. Yep, look at this. I mean, yeah, what I mean, class? that's styling. See that little indentation? Styling is just... And of course, it would flip this up or down, right. depending on where you had it. Look at look at the stainless here. Stainless, Steve. that's chrome. This is chrome. Right yeah, here. yeah, that's beautiful. Beautiful. Let's open it up. Real Jim. chrome. Let's open it up. You know. And and Harry, uh, the top is removable. Tell us about the top, and it you were telling removable. us the differences. It's fiberglass. Um, so this is fiberglass, but the car is all metal. Yeah, when okay. you ordered it, standard equipment was the hard top. It was an option to go with a convertible top, but you could have both. There's room under there for me to put a convertible top in. Have yes, both. Sir. But it's funny, this Florida title of mine says hard top only. Wow. wow. So on the title. That's good. That's yeah. good. Yeah. Interesting. Wow. But yeah, it was cool with it. So they learned a lot of things like usual on the they first did. year car. Well, and so they made like changes. Like you saying, with the heat and the portal, yeah. Yeah. 56, people in 55 wanted to go golf and they had no room to put their golf clubs in the trunk with a spare tire in there. Makes sense. So 56, they came out with the Continental Make, Kit. Makes yeah. sense, yeah. Now, if you don't know what the Continental Kit is, it would have been where they put, really extended it back here a little bit, and then the tire, the tire would, would have been be right upright, there. horizontally this and it way. And flip out when you wanted it. Yeah, you know, and then you flip it lever. down, and then you can open the yeah. trunk. So yeah. it wasn't part of the trunk. So they gave you, like Harry said, uh, the whole trunk now, that you can use it. Now, did these ever come with air a system? They didn't come with air conditioning. Not that I no. know, no. Not that well, I never... you know, they did have an early air system. I found one. Did you? It's a big unit. Of course, the compressor looks like it's... Big as the engine. Looks like a small block Chevy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> there you go with the Chevy jokes. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But, uh, yeah, this never had the no. air. Yeah. Well, let's point out some things on the door here and get through the side. So, this. yeah, look, look, at, look so at this, Steve. I, I always love this I know, I know. look. The Trans Am had yeah, that yeah, look. Yeah. My uh, my Hellcat has that inside that same look. So it's carried on through this the years. This is rare, right yeah. here. Yeah, tell look us at, about that, Harry. Here. Look at this here. Tell us what we got going yeah, on here. Power seat. So power tell us. Seat. You were telling us the story oh, now yeah. about how that operates. 
uh, under this back shelf is a motor, pretty good sized motor. It looks like a blower motor on your heater. Mm -hmm. And off of it comes a screw drive down to a big assembly that's underneath the seat, a big cast piece. Mm -hmm. And that screw drive, <laughs> that whole drives seat. It, yeah. Unbelievable. I, I don't know how much it weighs, but it, it, it's crazy. It's got to be a lot. That's a lot, crazy. Yeah, well, yeah, again, the old cool. days, they just figured that's, out yeah. how to do it, right? Yeah. Well, we're talking like the early, like Lincoln's Mercury's in 1950 had a big starter motor for the power seat. Yeah. I mean, it was huge, you know, and all that. Oh, so, yeah. You know, now everything's like. Well, Ford's like, notorious for that one. Yeah, yeah, uh, the retractable yeah, top. Yeah, retractable yeah, top. Yeah. But, but look at it in here. Yeah, come column. on up. Let's show come them. Come on up uh, here. Uh, I wanted, uh, if you don't mind, Harry was showing us the keys on this side. Uh, usually every other key is on the other side, on right, right side. side Cause most people are right handed. Right, right. And a factory tack. Yeah. That this, is, uh, tell them a little bit about that, Harry. Yeah, they all came with a tack. Of course, this one isn't hooked up because you know, it goes up to, what, 5,000 I figure with that big engine in there, you might've <laughs> twisted a few times around. <laughs> but also the speedometer has a, Plexiglass. Oh yeah, yeah. look at that. If you can out. get it from the outside, guys, look right here. Yeah, it's right look here. Look down through the windshield. And the, and the light would come through here, huh? Yeah. And give you a better... Uh, right. The, the right. Yeah, right. very cool. I thought at first like a heads up, but it's not. Yeah. It's just a reflection. Here, come here. I want to show you guys this. Look at uh, look at the horn. Of course, this you push this. Look at yeah, That's yeah. Cool. the speedometer goes to 150, which was very unusual, by the way. Here's wow. your fuel gauge, your temp gauge. Of course, tack like he told you. You got your lights over there. Uh, These are for here's your air conditioner right here, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah it's called a vent, so a vent, little flap yeah. opens up underneath, and it just allows the Less air to come air in. Come through here, yeah. Uh, here's your wipers, uh, cigarette lighter. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> now these had Wonder Bar radios, didn't they? Uh, no, 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 not this no. one. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But here's how you do this, guys. You set your channel That's with AM. this, and then you pull this out. And, and, and push it back into set. So if you ever want to find your channel, you just push whichever button. Here's the uh, ashtray. Ashtray. Yeah, it pulls up. It's, it's, Let's leave it there. Okay, yeah, I'll leave yeah, it there. Yeah. And here's your heater. Heater. Yep. And then what's this blower for? Is that for your heater? That's the heater. Okay, so there's like a blower that just blows the heat yeah, here. Yeah, nice if it was a real blower. And here's your yeah. glove compartment. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And now here's PC. what's nice too. This is all uh, like vinyl. I guess yeah. that's like a vinyl. Yeah. Factory vinyl. So it's yeah. kind of the first years of a padded yeah. Look at all the chrome no, no up pad. in here. Oh, just vinyl? Yeah. Oh, you were oh, telling okay. us too. Now this is, and, and look at this cool original shifter. So this is a four speed and it's a, what top, kind? Top loader four speed. Top loader four speed, which is really a well-known old yeah. school hot oh, rod yeah. four speed. They originally only came with three speeds. Right. Right, right. right. Four automatics. Yeah. But then they had the eBird too. Yeah. Yeah. They had the eBird. Oh had, yeah, that's right. It had two right. fours in it. It had power seat, power windows. Well, then like they the have then one. they have one Harry with fuel injection. No, but they no? have one with a uh, turbo. Turbo, a okay. Blow, blow yeah, that's what it was. Like a McCullough, yeah, supercharger. Yeah, or something yeah. Like that. Look okay. at the two tone interior and right. the tuck and roll. And these, the you sat right on the floor. You sat oh yeah, the yeah. Well, look, you're you're in an angle, and it's actually very comfortable. Yeah. Wow, what? And this is a, a speaker for yeah. the radio here. It's wow. the only speaker you got, right? That's it. Yeah, that's so it. So that's the only no, speaker. No four way, six way. It's like way, a six. Nothing. Here's how you undo the top. Look here. You, you unclip these, unclip this, and then there's clips in the back as well. If you want to look back in the back, you can now, see. How long has this so all here been you done? Do you pull think out, this here you pull out, theory. and then you lift the whole thing um, off. Probably. And then here too. 15 years. 15 years? Yeah. Eight, okay. What was it before? Do you know? Yeah, originally they came with 292s or. 312. Okay. And uh, the original car was 193 horsepower. You're, you're pushing over 450, 500 on this. Yeah. Well, we'll get around. Yeah, we'll get around. Yeah. That. Okay, yeah. All right. All right. Can we open the trunk real yeah. quick? Let me get the key. Okay. okay. Uh, as he's doing that, and come on, Steve, this, uh, what a gorgeous back it end. It is. It is. Yeah. Uh, here's, here's where you put your fuel. Right. So you unscrew but this. If you notice, and the, fuel. if you notice, though, the cap is there and the lid is there, but you can still open up, show it when you open it up, you can still yeah. open the trunk, open up the trunk up. Oh it's, yeah, it's a, yeah, it's yeah, this is, purpose, yeah. Like, yeah. Well, you can see right yeah. here what you're saying, right, the right. gap right here. If you it's not like in close. the trunk. Yeah, you can see it's, you'll see when we open it. It's but, pretty neat how they did yeah, that, integrated yeah. and all And again, together. the little finger thing yeah, like you were saying. I like and them. these, I like what else is cool is they're spring loaded. Yeah. You know, I mean, it goes back by itself. And uh, go ahead and point out the back here, Harry. Okay. Very similar to the sedan on the taillights. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, 
55 was the only year with the exhaust coming through the bumper. That's back. That is so course, cool. These are a little bit larger tubes yeah. than originally. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. The, and what a cool, cool like design. Like now, Steve, look how it's indented here with the license right, plate right, and everything. Right, right, you know, right. it's, I mean, again, the style is style unbelievable. Is unbelievable. What were you going to say? Uh, where where'd the car originally come from? Do you know? Well, I found it in Mount Dora. Okay. A uh, guy, one year older than me. Uh, Young just, guy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> just you throw him off with that one. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> well, I tell you. You can't be an old, small, wimpy guy to drive this thing. Oh, oh no. And we'll trunk. point that out up there. But let's go ahead and look at the trunk real yeah, quick. Yeah, he used to race them with 390s. Okay. And then he came across this 427 engine after he stopped racing them. Oh. Unbelievable. I mean, this it. is. Really nice guy. Big. This is. This is an unbelievable oh, car. Oh, look at you that. You can see oh, yeah. why they had to go with the Continental kit. Yeah, yeah. It's not much room, yeah. Spare. Yeah, I see. Yeah. It takes up most you put your battery in all look, that battery. Look how little it is this way, Steve. I bet that's only like, I don't yeah. know, 14 inches yeah, at the deepest like part. Yeah, but yeah. here it's probably only six inches. Right. And you got the battery in the trunk. Yeah, I mounted it in the trunk. Yeah. And of course, this might give away some of the... Yeah, yeah. This... This will give you a hint for the motor. This must be used with every fill up of 93 octane. Yeah. Must be used Luckily, for this motor. Here in Florida, I don't know if it's other parts of the country, but Murphy at Walmart carries 93 non ethanol. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, that's good to know. Uh, uh, this, this one here does not, but where we. Okay. Yeah. Where you live. Uh, the reason that the battery is in the right, if you'll ever notice in a car, well, almost always 99.9%, .9%, it's in the right rear of the car and the reason that is is because of torque of the motor and you're wanting to get your traction on that right rear side Keep the weight so function. you put your weight yep in the back plus right you're side. on that side so you know you don't want you want to even it out yeah too. well it's really not yeah. your weight no, it's really no, the no, torque of the motor down. and how the right. car, you know cars turn sure, like sure. that so the majority of them, majority so. of it, yeah. yeah so super cool i want to get guys i want to get up to oh uh, like they were saying see oh, yeah. how this just opens yeah, up, it just opens up. Yeah, there's your gas that's right really cool yeah that is really cool so, now who designed this t-bird do you know oh yeah i, mean, I you forget know, I the name not harley heard. earl he didn't no yeah. he didn't have nothing to do yeah. that. he was gm yeah. here of course it says thunderbird right on the side very cool i mean I, again man i i just love guys the styling oh, they beautiful. put in back there beautiful. those those Krager ss are perfect on this oh area. it's beautiful just yeah, perfect school. now they did yeah. have fender skirts yeah they do okay yeah it was that an option in 55 yeah. okay and here's your antenna and this go can i put this up or no yeah okay this i want you guys to see this Look at that. That was it, yeah. <laughs> now, we learned from somebody, right, Steve? Wasn't it 32 inches Something is real, the yeah, maximum? Max, yeah, everybody the, used to have them way up there with Yeah, yeah, and, and, they, and they said like 32 yeah, inches or yeah, something would have yeah. been the ideal. And I also, remember in the 60s, though, with AM radio, living in northern Ohio, I could pick up WLS in Chicago. Yeah, yeah. Or Detroit. It's uh, amazing. That, AM radio. CKLW out of Detroit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. was kind of cool. Yeah, that's at awesome. Night, so you had to be way, Just, way yeah, 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 yeah. Take it off when you go through a car wash. Or you will not have it when you come out. Well, I bet you never <laughs> take this. Go I'm just going to yeah, say I know, that. I know, I know, Guys, let's get to yeah, the, let's get the, to the, the main I'm part ready. here. We, come on, we got Harry. To, uh, we're ready for this, Harry. We're ready for this, man. I, I've been dying to get here. Dun, 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 dun. Do the drum roll. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really cool too. Notice the hood opens like a, a, a Corvette, but it yeah. opens from the back side Which up forward. Nice. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Look, Look at, at a this. 427. Now, yeah, Harry, let's let you run with it, buddy. Yes. Okay, now this is Ford 427. Ford. Yeah, not Ford, a Chevy. Ford came out with them in 63, and this is a 64 motor out of a Ford Galaxy. Mm hmm. And they came with, you could get them with two fours or single four. The unique thing about this is these carbs are turned around backwards. So Holly. See right here? See it turn around? There's a metering block right here. If they were to put one right here, it would hit the distributor. So they had to turn the carbs backwards. Yeah, so my work. primaries are on this side. And uh, takes now, a little bit of adjusting to tune it. 
I didn't know FE was Ford Edsel. That's right. It's an FE block. Yeah, FE block. And it's cross drilled for the main bearings in the rear. Yeah, it's uh, cross bolted. Cross bolted. Yeah. yeah. It's got angle plug head shown angle there, plug Steve, heads on the side. Right here. Uh, one of the unique headers, things. Headers, yeah. Now here. notice how the exhaust ports come out. Point them out there, uh, See Steve. You're here. Uh, that that's okay. way that's different than the Chevy. Giveaway. Yeah. Giveaway. Also, yeah. the valve covers. Look how tall and thin, and tall. even the angle of them is a bit different right. than what you would see right. on, say, yeah. a Chevy. Now these valve covers, if I'm correct, I found these out of Long Island, New York on eBay. So cool. They're super rare. I think they're 67 Shelby GT500. Really? No really? way. There was like 50 Shelbys built in 67. They had the 427. Okay. Then they came out with the 428. Wow. So these valve covers, I believe, are super rare. Wow. wow. Yes. I mean, the whole car is, yeah, so especially cool. the 2.4 intake and yeah. everything. Yeah, um, yeah, the intake's very right, rare, right. too. That's right. factory 64. Yeah, wow. You've got a nice little bump stick there, as they call it, a cam. Yeah, you know, Lopi cam, Lunati cam, Lunati, but right, they, right, and they're solid lifter. The factory S solid lifter was always solid. Yeah, lifter. yeah. No, yeah. when I was a kid growing up, guys in the neighborhood with big engine, big engines and small cars. I mean, you have very little room here, here. Right. On right. the other side, you have no room. So a lot of guys took torches and did things. Oh bad. yeah, but this car, this engine, uh, really, they did a great job putting this engine in. Yeah, yeah. this Let's guy was good at it. Let's point out some things. He put a, a this is a three core radiator, but it but is big, an aluminum big, radiator, big right? Holes. Obviously, yeah. the motor's been moved back, correct? Yeah. Okay, uh, tell us about that. Well, factory motor was the old Y block was positioned about the same, about the same spot. Same spot. Uh, but the front um, cast iron um, timing chain cover and water pump were huge on the Y block. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. And really heavy duty. But so the engine, I don't think it's any longer than a wide block. In fact, it may be shorter. Wow. And see how the- uh, Look how factory, nice this fits. This is factory shroud. Oh, yeah. that's a factory shroud. And I cannot get my finger through there. Right. Uh, it's yeah, it runs close. very close. Does it run 185? Uh, actually, uh, if it's cool outside, I'll go below that. Wow, that's 65. great. That's great. Wow. But I mean, everything fits nice. And, and we're talking about the engine so far back. What's it do? Helps with traction. Right, yeah. that's right. Yeah, yeah. Handling. I'm sitting back on the rear axle. This is back. So the tires aren't very big. Maybe, in the back. maybe, the uh, launch Harry, is good. Maybe yeah. When he awesome. leaves, he could show us a little show. All right, a couple know. things over here, if you can see here. He's got manual brakes. Manual he was brake. saying no you got to be a man to drive this. <laughs> yes, so. yes. You got that's a two footer. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so you got manual brakes. You got manual steering. Come take a look at this yeah, real quick because it's a very basic. Yeah. Um, just this, look. Go ahead, Harry. This tube had to be modified. Yeah. Otherwise, see that? you can see right there. Uh, big block. They but did a great job. Here's on your it. manual brake. Here's your manual steering. So it's basically just a straight yeah, rod yeah, going down yeah. and you're just manhandling it. Now, you talk about that straight rod until the mid to late 60s, they put a collapsible column because this would go through a lot of people's chest. Oh, yeah. When you get a head on crash. That. Yeah, that would kill the people because of that. You know, so uh, that's what they eliminated that after, yeah. I think, 66, 67. But, yeah, uh, man, it's wow. beautiful, Harry. Yeah, here's the fuel filter here. That's factory 64. Right there. What's cool about this? This came in. You said a Fairlane or Galaxy? Galaxy. Yeah. Galaxy. I mean, it, which Galaxy would have been really a family car. I mean, they made some sporty ones. They made but, a 409 in the uh, uh, not 409, 406. But think about that. 406, it, 406 yeah. and a 427. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, but think about they that. Had to run with Hemmings. Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 And, and NASCAR. Yeah, and NASCAR. NASCAR they, will, they cleaned up on NASCAR yeah, yeah, these, this yeah. year, but um, I just lost my train of thought. Um, well, the day um, well, did they came in the Thunderbolt, the Ford Thunderbolt. Oh, that's, yeah, that's right. You yeah, brought that up bolt, earlier, yeah. Steve. Oh, no, I love the Thunderbolt. Yeah, yeah you're, if you don't Little remember body. the Thunderbird guys, about this it up. size, huh? So yeah, yeah, Thunderbolt was pretty lightweight. Yeah. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. I'll tell you what. You really, I, this is, they're getting better and better, Chip, aren't they? Yeah, this, I this mean, is this is a gorgeous, Thank gorgeous you. car. Now, how much horsepower do you think you got running in this? Well, they came with, uh, they were rated 425. Of course, that was probably a little bit low. Underrated, uh, yeah. I know they have 480 pounds of torque. This Huge the amount. The body and the um, tube headers instead of the cast iron. Yeah. Uh, Headers. Yeah, they had yeah. really nice cast iron. Exhaust. Yeah. Fit. 
It's maybe about 450, somewhere around yeah. there. Still, man, yeah, a little light man. car. What's this car weigh, do you think? 28. Have any at idea? one time, I, I think it was, I remember, right, somewhere around 29. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wow, that's wow. light. Uh, My that's Duster's 3,000. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. and that's been lightened up to race. No, I anyway. Just, I just wanted to thank you again. Oh, man, just, I love this a, car. This is incredible. And, yeah. and he has another one coming up that's going to be incredible. I know. That's all we're, know. Say. we're looking. That's all we're going to say to everybody. Well, it's guys, it. we hope you enjoyed yeah. it. Yep. I'm Chip. I'm Steve. I'm Harry. And this, this is Chip's, Chip's Garage. Garage. Thanks, Harry. Hey, thanks, Harry. We got on it in a while. I hope it doesn't keep going. No, no, no. Here we go. Just be careful, buddy. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, there we go. <laughs>